So this is test tube division with a two digit divisor and I'll be recording all of my work. So the problem is 49,082 divided by 23. Here's the divisor, 23. Here's the dividend in beads, 49,000, no hundreds, 82. And in division, we have to distribute to the divisor, starting with the largest parts of the dividend. So 10 thousands will go to the tens place of the divisor, units of thousands to the units place of the divisor. And they have to have exactly the same amount. So I can't go any further and give everyone their fair share. So what I can see is that the units place gets two thousands, two in the thousands place. And I also need to record what I've used up. So I used four ten thousands or 40,000, six units of thousands. I had 49,000. I've distributed 46,000, and that means I should have three left. Okay, so I'm clearing the board. So I'll move ten thousands out of the way, slide thousands over, bring down the hundreds, and show the hundreds place on paper as well. So I have three thousands to distribute. And I have no hundreds, but I can exchange 1,000 for 10 hundreds. And this is as far as I can go. So everybody gets their fair share. And what I'll record is a one in the hundreds place of the quotient. And I also want to record what I've used up, which are two thousands and three hundreds. It looks like 23. 23. And what I have left in my cup are seven hundreds. So 30 minus 23 equals seven. And now I'll clear the board. I'll slide hundreds to the tens place and bring down the tens, which are eight. And on paper, I'll bring down the tens place. And now distribute hundreds to the tens. I need to exchange this last hundred. For ten tens. And this is as far as I can go. So the units place gets three tens. So I'll record three in the tens place. And I also need to record what I used up. Six hundreds and nine tens. This looks like 69. And I have nine remaining in my cup. And 
and I can subtract on paper. And that shows me that I should have nine remaining. Okay, so I'm going to clear the board. I'm finished with hundreds. I'll slide tens over to the tens place and bring down the units. And on paper, I'll also bring down the units. So I'll distribute tens to the tens place. Units to the units. We need to exchange. And continue. So the answer is what one unit gets, which is a four in the units place. Four. And I had 92, and I've used everything up, so I'm going to check and see if this is actually, this actually adds up to 92. So I used 20, 40, 60, 80, plus 3 taken 4 times is 12. 80 plus 12 is 92. I had 92, and I used 92, and I had no remainder.